Hello everyone and welcome back to Transport Fever 2. My name is Geralt and today we are going to continue expanding the transportation empire in the United States of America. Before we begin, please take a moment to click the like button and subscribe to the channel. Guys, I think uploading every day is taking a toll on me and I feel it's unsustainable long term. I'm thinking of moving to four episodes per week and I will try to keep a consistent schedule for Monday, Wednesday, Friday and Saturday. And now let's start today's episode. So first thing for today, shout out to Steven Spry again for giving great advice. One of the things that he suggested is to make my ship lines with less alternative terminals. I did that. I really think that it helps or at least definitely it seemed like it is helping a lot. So thank you again, Steven. Now I have made a few changes behind the scenes as usual, as you would expect. I guess I will start from left to right. Um, I've changed this port a little bit. This is how it looks now. I'm trying to follow more or less the same idea with the other ports, but yeah, it's not big changes, it's small ones. Also, I have added a few more waypoints just to keep the, the lines uh, organized, not to make some huge expanding ship lines outside of the ports, like in some places you might see, or not anymore, I think I fixed them all. You see, everything looks super tidy right now. Anyhow, this is uh, the port of New Orleans Refinery. I think I changed this one as well. Yep, this is how it looks as well. This one is also changed. It was previously here. Now it's on that side because the ships are going to the New Orleans Refinery port and not like before, like, like initially they were to the Southeast Distribution Center port. This one I think I haven't touched. Um, yeah, I think this one we finished in the previous episode. Sure, yes we did. There is more waypoints here, a few more here, just, just to keep the, the lines organized, you know. Um, yeah, Miami also has changed its port a little bit. Uh, I pushed it a little bit forward, just in case if I need to put some buildings on both sides. This is how the terminals look. Havana as well is changed, I believe so, yep. There we go, here as well, there is space for buildings here as well. Um, this one I think as well for Bahamas. Yeah, also pushed it a little bit forward, create a longer connection to the street and I have space for more buildings if the need arises. It's very nice to see that the passengers are finally using the ships. I think this is the same as we left it in the last episode. This is a little bit smaller because I think six terminals don't make much sense. And yeah, that's it pretty much. Um, I finished the line here. I also, of course, I removed this. Uh, actually, you can see the it's it's like a ghost of the of the line. Let's actually fix this a little bit. What tree is here? It's always the same one, right? This one. So strength? No, definitely not that much. Can I have a few more? Maybe a little bit more strength. Ah, there we go. Yeah, just to hide where, where we have had our line before. Okay, that looks better now. Perfect. Okay. So, we have this line. Ah, actually, let's go back again to uh, what Steven suggested. Oh my god, this looks amazing, no? All these ships going for their destinations. At least I think it looks amazing. Now, uh, one thing I certainly don't love is that I don't see any oil stacking up around here. Or maybe they're just picking it up. No, not, not yet, at least. I think the, it's going to take some time because the trains that are bringing the... Crude, yeah, the crude for the Savannah refinery have to come and then has to be transferred to here and then the ships are going to take it. But yeah, all right, so this is how 
we look here i have moved these things here on the left and these guys are on the right everything that goes to this direction is on the right and everything this direction is on the left there will be a few more popping up here in the future i have plans for them so don't worry you will you will see what's happening and how uh they have less uh alternative terminals let's pin this here just to show you so as you can see there is only four for this one four for this one the crude oil for savannah as well has four bahamas has four havana has four miami has four tnc has four offshore three has four and so on and so forth i don't think i will have traffic jumps or anything like that uh but still i will see how the game develops and if we have some ships stuck in there before the port we will take the necessary precautions now i'm very curious why we're not seeing the why we're not seeing here the fuel it's very very interesting like we are certainly producing it this is going down that's not nice did i did i make something wrong Hmm. Oh. Oh, yes, I did. I didn't buy the ships. <laughs> well, that's a rookie mistake, but we can very easily solve it. I think we should do 20. And this is oil, fuel, Charlotte. Yeah, so all these ships here, they are for the other line, of course, of course, for this one. Okay, okay that's fine okay let's play the game now i think now we're going to start seeing maybe yes you see now we're starting to go up which is great so now the question is do we need more buildings i will have to take a very close look at this um oof yeah well i really hope these ships are going to bring well eventually someday something <laughs> <laughs> do the refinery yeah it's already it's already stacking up here so that's that's a good thing um you know what i do have a bunch of space which is nice ah, i think this space is over here right on this um side of the port which doesn't have well that's actually very nice to see because i will not have to i will not need to build a lot of buildings great great that's good that's good i'm liking it Speaking of that, by the way, I think it might not be a bad idea to turn the ships around. Or just let them... Because this is going to... Yeah, this is going to... It's going to have a ton... A ton of... Uh, oh, this one has. Oh, this one as well. So there you go, you see? Okay, let's turn you around. Uh, everything has to be Savannah, right? Root oils for savannah. Root oil for savannah. I can actually maybe even change this line to to force them to stop there and to wait. Just just for the time being, you know. Let's do this. So that we don't have empty trips because they literally take forever to get there. Although we have the correct rate that we are looking for. 415 that doesn't mean that we're not going to have a ton of oil here zero oil is going to be produced in savannah so yeah and now we have these ships <laughs> oh my god there might be a little bit of a traffic jump but that's just going to be for now okay i think that's everything about the new ports oh no of course not um Bermuda has also changed. This is how we are looking at right now. Uh, did I show the TNC? Yeah, this is how TNC looks as well. I think it looks a little bit more orderly and it's uh, following the same design or at least in principle uh, in most of the places. And New York as well. I decided to move it here. First of all, it's closer to the station. Gives me more options. I just think it looks better here and now the street on this side uh can just be free of ports uh let's fix some of the things that i cost on this 
um, beach. Let's actually take a bigger one. Yeah, let's do this. Just give it to me, please. There we go. This looks good. Okay, let's smooth it out a little bit. Can we do it? Oh my god, is the game lagging or... And I'm just on double speed. That's certainly not good. Maybe it's because I'm terraforming and that takes resources. Okay. Um, let's see. What else do I have in store? I have here. I saw that I am getting a lot of construction material stacking up from time to time. And I do not love this. I think I'm going to do something to help my station here. Oh my god, it's kind of slow. I think after I do terraforming, it's just it becomes insanely slow. Uh, we need a cargo building. Just for some extra space, you know. Okay, maybe on that side is going to be a little bit of a problem. Because of the road. Hmm. We can certainly do something about this. I can also try to just destroy it all together and then rebuild it. I don't mind doing that, to be honest. If it's going to be problematic with me. Let's put this here. Perfect. Now let's get out of here and go to city streets. We want this one. And I can connect it like that. Perfect. There we go. We fixed the problem very, very quickly. And that's it. Now I'm going to have a little bit more space. I know it doesn't look amazing, but what can we do? I was just thinking of like extending this platform here. That could be if I need more because someday I'm going to start utilizing the other side as well. You see, that's the problem here. We have 72% because I am losing construction material from time to time. And now we have plenty, plenty. Sorry. Plenty, plenty. Not that much, but definitely more than before. Uh, and if I need, I will expand it even more. All right. Cool. So what is next? Um, I realized that Tampa and Atlanta are not getting... Ah, actually, yes, they are. Fuel delivery Tampa. Okay, uh, I guess... Ah, this was a Florida, and then I added this to the ship, right? Yeah, so I think they're going to go to the East Coast. Unless I just add them, the two of them together. But I think... Let me see. So this one has two ships already. Two ships, oh my goodness. They, it has two uh, trains already. With fuel. The rate is 121. I'm super curious. That's that's per station. Hmm. So now this is very confusing, you know, because um, does that mean that every station has 120 or per year I'm delivering 120? It's I don't know what to say here. But anyway, we're going to try to add it and see if we get uh, the delivery server. I don't see any fuel stacking up, but at least not that much. So that means that we are definitely utilizing it. So I'm curious if someone actually has uh, some input on that. Um, when I have a line like this one, that delivers its cargo to multiple stations. And we have a rate of 121. Okay, the frequency is low, but we don't care much about it. Um, does that mean that I deliver 121 per year to all the stations combined? Or to each station? It's a very good question, I think. Uh, generally speaking, if we follow the game logic, which I know, that means that this is on average on a station. And that doesn't work very well for me, because in this case, I will have to create for each CD its uh, separate delivery. Which is not that bad, but it's not the best. Uh, it's not ideal, you know? 
mean, I can technically decide, okay, so my rate for Boston has to be 40 plus 45 plus 48, and then, like, kind of put two wagons here and four for each of those, and that's going to make it work, right? But it's not ideal. I wanted to have um, lines like these ones where I deliver go the goods to multiple cities, but I don't know how to make the calculation so that it's optimal. I don't think it currently is, as you can see. Uh, I don't know how to find a solution to this because we are 25, 28, 45. Um, I can keep increasing and see. Maybe that's going to work. So we are at uh, 125, was it? Yeah, let's keep it 121. Uh, and we definitely have a lot of demand here. Let's see, that's 60. That's 110 already. Yeah. And 45. And is that everything? New York, Washington, Charlotte. Yeah. And also New York is delivering or it's attempting to deliver to Bermuda as well. And Bermuda has a core resource fuel. So it seems like most of them are like around... What is it? Three-fifths. So that's like 60%. 60% full, right? This one is absolutely full, but that's, I guess, because I deliver a ton here and just some of them gets to, to Bermuda. Hmm. And New York is the first station, of course, so it gets the most. But then we have... And that's more than 60%. And this is, this is around 60%, I think. Yeah. So, yeah, I my idea was that if I have this rate... And I add up all the demand that they have on this route. This is going to fill all of them to the maximum, to 100% of their demand. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Interesting. That's very interesting. Why you don't go to some of the alternative uh, terminals? Because you have already decided. Ah, uh, because that's your main one. Okay, but it's not free. Can you use another one? Also, why are you returning? Where are you return? Ah, yeah, yeah. It's New York. is a station like that. Hmm... What if I change it? And you? What are you doing? Are you have? Uh, are they having the the same main one here? Maybe that's the problem. No, they are actually part of the same line. Oh, I see. So. Hmm. But but why why he doesn't take the alternative? That's that's a very good question. I mean they're free, I think. Right? These two in the middle. Or or it already made its choice where it wants to go and it doesn't want to go anywhere else. Well that means that means that this has to go. This cannot be there. And I guess that means the same about this one and then maybe i will not have that problem hopefully who's going to go now you're going to go we're up to this guy or you're going to use an alternative terminal let's see if we're going to find a solution yes so now you do want to use one super weird stuff hmm Good, okay, at least we solved the problem. And uh, what is that? That's on a construction material delivery. Okay, okay, good, good. Cool, so yeah, that's about the fuel deliveries. I um, I would really hope to have such an arrangement. I think my calculations are correct. So please, guys, share your thoughts, ideas, if you have any about it. Um, speaking of that, let's, let's do what I said we want to do. So we want to add 
Atlanta has now 45. Let's see where it is. Oh, yeah, I will need to create a drop for this fuel. Right? Absolutely. Okay, so we need... We need to do that. So we need a line from this station to the drop station. This is delivering fuel, so this is going to be cargo tram. Uh, fuel drop pipe Atlanta. Okay, so here you can take the alternatives. We need to open this one just to check if everything is okay there. And I also have to see if I have the, the tram, right? Tram trucks. Now, one thing I will try to fix in this episode as well is a mistake that I made. And here I told in some of the other uh, drop lines to wait uh, until it's until full, until they're full. And that blocks my stations. So I will have to fix that in this episode. Uh, actually, let's call this um, industry drop. Okay, and you, my friend, the fuel drop, you are not going to unloading and only going to load fuel and you're only going to unload there. Good. Now, let's open you here. Be new. Come to the tools. Take the tram. Yeah, you see, we don't. So let's put this here and here and here. And upgrade everything necessary. Perfect. Okay, you know, at the same time, at the same time, no, at the same time, absolutely not. I would not like you to do that. Hmm, because I don't want my line to pass so close to the, resi the residence because that's going to increase our emissions. So I have to start being smarter about it. So why don't we go from here like that and then here? Okay, so we are currently using this one. Maybe we want to use Atlanta fuel drop. I already have a fuel drop. Oh, I didn't know that I do. I guess I forgot to add it uh, to the other one, but I already have this one set up. Okay, but that doesn't mean that I shouldn't fix it, right? Okay, so let's choose here terminal the other one let's see what happens with our line okay, so you just decided to do that but no instead i would like you to so you're going to come here and then you're going to make a right and you're going to pass through a waypoint a waypoint here manage line so after the int drop come here please and that's it and we are keeping it as far away as possible. Okay, do we have uh, vehicles here? We actually have one that delivers 52. Which is fine. So I just have to add this to the... Delivery East Coast. 38 years, guys. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, they're full, right? Yeah, they're big, big trains. Um, I will do... Copy. And see if that's going to help us. And also we are going to manage the line. And we are going to... After Charlotte. Charlotte is here. We are going to come to Atlanta. I think it makes complete sense. Because from Atlanta. Then we can just... Enter here, right? Yeah, come here and enter from here. Perfect. So add station. Come to the cargo. Uh, terminal, terminal, terminal. Okay, I will check the terminal later. But you can also take the alternatives. Um, and just unload. And that's it. 416. Yeah, I think... I think something was wrong here. <laughs> Alright, I will absolutely sell this one. Although it's full. Mm, I don't want to wait for it. 
Okay, then this one, is it full? No, this one can be sold. Manage vehicle. Sell. Yes. Okay, and now I just have to come here and see in which terminal I put you. One. The stone is already on one. Actually, the stone can go on two and you can stay on one. I think I like that more. Okay, good. Good, good, good. That's it. So Atlanta is now added. Hopefully we're going to start seeing some fuel here. Let's see. Is Panama... Panama does not have a fuel delivery, which is also bad. It has some demand. So let's see. Oh, is that going to be a bad, bad news? Oh, no. Okay, perfect. So we are going to add it to the Tampa one. In this case. Um, Tampa. Let's call this Florida because they're both in Florida. No. Okay. Okay, good. <laughs> Florida. Your delivery Florida has 32. Okay. First thing is first. Let's add, manage the line. And also come from here. Let's add station. This station. Let's pin you here. Here in the station. Let's see the terminal. Well, we only have two. So, yeah. Um, okay. Let's manage the line. Let's use them both. Here is only unload, thank you. And that's going to do it. It's going to pass first through Panama. I don't think it matters in this case. So I'm going to leave it like that. And we just have to calculate, right? This is 25. Uh, and Tampa is 53. So let's say 60, 80. Let's say 80. So our rate of 64 is not enough wagons root oil one two maybe that's too much 90 no it's fine it's fine 90 is fine okay um i will tell you why i'm doing this um i'm doing this because i realized that i have 1032 demand for oil and that's going to require us to first connect everyone that needs oil and also create even more production. And I will do this later in this episode. So I just want to check if I have connected everyone. Boston is connected. No, Boston is also not connected. And Boston has 21. It's something, you know. It's something. And the fuel is hopefully, hopefully, hopefully inside of the station. Great. So... Actually, that makes our job even easier. Uh, let's manage this line and after New York, come to the cargo station here. Let's just unload and use both terminals. And it, that's perfect. All right. 236. That's okay. Um, I will count maybe later and see if it's okay. Okay, Savannah is too small, I guess, to want fuel. And probably Savannah is going to be part of the Florida one in the future when it needs to have fuel. Oh, there is fuel here in Nashville. Hmm. Nashville might be part of a different network. For now, I am not going to be bothered with it. Uh, let's see New Orleans and Houston has a primary resource and we are definitely not doing well. Um, let's see what the problem might be. 296 is absolutely good. Going to leave it like that. Who else? Who else? Oh no. Oklahoma. Oh, and it's a primary resource. Oh my god. Okay, you know what? I think these two can be part of one system. But how? I don't have a connection between Nashville and Oklahoma unless I come here and then I make this circle and then go back. I think that's going to be it. Yeah. But let's deliver some, you know. This is going to be a line from the SEDC. No. Then no. <laughs> Sorry. Wrong station. Uh, from here, go to Nashville Cargo Station. And from Nashville Cargo Station, go to 
Oh, not here, but go to Oklahoma. Where are you going to go from? Let me see. You go from the proper side. Yeah, because then you're going to come here. Going to take this. And here going to enter on this side. And from here, you're going to join and go to Nashville. Okay, that works for me. Yeah, in the distribution center, first let's do cargo rail. And this is going to be hmm. It's going to be what? Uh fuel delivery. Hmm. Nash. Oklahoma. Oh, mm-hmm. Now here we have nine. Okay, I will check you later. Let's be not later, but I will check you now. Yeah, so we come here, we come this way, make the circle, bridge, and go there. So that's fine. Let's just see the terminals. I have been put at nine. There is no one at nine, so we can take nine. Let's manage the line and give it alternative terminals. In this case, everything from 8 to 14. Okay. Uh, please have a full load. Thank you. And wait maximum 10 minutes. And I want you to not unload and only load fuel. Let's give you also the color. Okay. In Nashville, you can take both. And you will just unload. And in Oklahoma, you can take them all. And also only unload. And that should do it. Now, the last calculation that we need is to check again. This is, let's say, 30. 30 plus. So 170. I'm going to strive for 170. Where is where depot here? The depot here might work pretty well. So let's take our locomotive. The beautiful one. Let's take uh, cargo, root oil, and let's take this one. Let's see how we're doing with one. We need 170. Oh, let's assign it, of course. Fuel delivery, Nash, Oklahoma. Four. Oh my god. This is not going to be easy. In this case, I need to do this 85 or 90. Oh, and that's going to be 10, 15, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 15. One train. What did I do? Oh, I didn't edit it. Hmm, okay. Uh, let's just assign it then to Nash, Oklahoma. That's 15. 56. Only 56 with 15? Does that make sense? Oh my god, this is terrible. Is it that long? Really? Man, these fuel deliveries. Okay, let's uh, see what happens if we uh, stack them up to the max. 320. Modify. And the other one as well. 170. Okay, so this is going to get to the max as well. 170? Yeah. Okay, so two trains is 170. I cannot believe it. This is going to be insane. <laughs> okay. Okay, so Nashville and Oklahoma are now connected as well. The game is absolutely lagging. Uh, this might become unplayable very soon, <laughs> which is unfortunate for me. 368 fuel New Orleans refinery. This is not enough. Let's see how, how this is going to help. 429. Okay, I think I can remove one. 398. Okay, cool. I will add it. I prefer to be above 400. Alright. Now. Ooh, that's a bunch of construction material, you know? The delivery to Florida. 
Yeah, here we had uh, 161 and 44. Hey, you know what? I was I started delivering by ship, didn't I? I did. And are we still coming here? Yes, so this should be removed. I guess I forgot to do that. Miami, goodbye. 691 is something that I certainly don't need. Um, oh, I, I guess for now we are just going to manage the vehicle and we are going to make it shorter. I need... What was it? 160... I think I need pretty much nothing on this train. Yeah, 173 is going to deliver enough for Panama. Cool. Um, nice. Another thing that might be a good idea as well. Did we start delivering? Yes, the fuel to Miami by ship. And this is too much. This is uh, much more than necessary. I also realized that Havana is having a separate one and they're basically the same line. I can just add another stop here and fix that. So we're going to manage this vehicle and we're going to assign it to the Miami one. Fuel delivery Miami. There we go. We're going to manage this line and remove it. And now we're going to come here and we are going to manage this line by adding this station as well with its alternative terminal and unloading we have 114 rate which is fine i think 61 plus 37 i think we are good oh that was very fast the bahamas the bahamas has a main resource uh fuel oh my god look at that uh so i think it's going to have its own 191 is good now for the island here i think i also set up one yes 44 no 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 70 i think we're just going to copy them both 88 is good and that's it now i'm very curious what's going to happen with all of these ships when they come back they're probably empty because they didn't bring anything add some fuel is there okay uh 410 okay this is still keeping the same number 602 is probably too much let's manage some vehicles uh very good very good okay i want empty vehicles okay you are not like almost none of them are probably going to be fully empty but i can sell this one in the meantime i can also pin this so that i can see what i'm doing what? Did I sell all the V? I... You know... Clicking buttons sometimes. What is this? Is it better than mine? I don't think so. Has more capacity. Hmm, tanker towboat, 200. Loading speed, oh, oh, let's compare. Let's pause the game actually while we compare. It's faster, faster loading speed. Actually, small size, that's super interesting. How is it a small size? It's beyond me. But capacity is 200. Okay, let's buy one of those and let's fix my mistake. What's the Savannah, right? Unbelievable. Unbelievable what I just did. 35. Okay, so I need just 10, 12. 12 of them. Well, at least that mistake showed me that I have a new boat which I can use. Which is great. Let's copy. And I said 12, right? So that's 4, 8, 12. Yeah, 419. Man, I cannot believe what I did here. Well, it's for the best. <laughs> okay. Um, 
Ok, ok, ok. What else? Um, so Bermuda. Bermuda. Yes, Bermuda is getting deliveries, which is good. I also increased the rate of the East Coast delivery there. So that's probably going to be good for us as well. Ok. Uh, what else? I also said that I want to fix something. And that is... Let's check. A line manager. I want to go to tram. And I want to find here... Um, cargo tram. Ok, so that's Atlanta fuel drop. This is a tram, right? Yeah. So here... Okay, this one I didn't... Oh, I also didn't tell it what to do, right? So you can load... Fuel. And in the in drop, just drop. Okay, good. Now... Houston. You see, that's the problem. Here... I don't... I want you to load if available. By the way, let's go to this. Let's go to this uh, line and see if. No, that's the best I can do. I think. I mean. Oh, they're very far, so there's no problems here. Okay, I fixed that one. Here is obviously just a load, so it doesn't matter. And here is load construction material. Okay, Houston fuel drop. Same, you see. Wrong. This cannot be like that. And also, no alternatives. You know, sometimes I. I'm in a hurry or something. Uh, okay, Miami fuel drop. Let's go. Let's click this again to load if available. Uh, the fuel drop here is looking good. Although, nah, that's the best I can do. Maybe I can just delete some of these residential buildings here and keep the residents a little bit farther away. And I see that they're mixing again, which I don't like. There is some fixing here that I have to do, certainly. Okay, Panama. Let's go to Panama. Panama is good. Load if available. But I have not selected the construction material. Tampa. Let's see. Tampa. Tampa, Central Cargo, Fuel Drop, again, load the fuel, and wash, see how wash is doing, again, load the fuel, thank you, that's it, that was very thick, uh, quick, I'm happy that we have the line manager to help me with that, hmm, something else I want to do, and I will just very quickly show you, uh, is... I would love to uh, check if I will be able to increase the public transportation expenditure. I'm really hoping that I'm going to start making a lot of money again because since I'm investing a lot, I don't know if I'm still in the green and the money is staying in the same level. So, I mean, that's fine, but we also have to make money, you know? So I will check what's going on with the money uh, and see if I can increase the public transportation financing so that we can lower the emissions all right um i think that's a lot of the things that i had to do for now i think we connected everything to the fuel and like i said we have 1032 currently and that's going to increase so a few things that we can do of course is to produce more so let's start i'm going to start connecting uh these babies here so we have two el paso oil well and houston oil well we have the houston oil refinery and we also have the houston fuel refinery and all of these can be connected with trucks and then ship and then another ship it's beautiful <laughs> undeniably oh also let's check what's going on here 35 hmm interesting okay i'm not going to do that now oh okay this one definitely needs you know let's make a quick check of um overloading okay mediocre houston rest one let's see what's going on here so that's mediocre okay houston internal one i mean not too many people and i'm not making a lot of money i can do something about this let's manage the vehicles where is my tram here tram depot 
Tram Depot, buy vehicles, manage vehicles, and then click. No, I just have to click buy vehicles. So uh, we have the slow one, which is cheap, but gives me more frequency, which is very important for things like that. Hmm, I think I might do that. We're going to take uh, the residential one. It was this one. Yeah, we are going to buy two of the slow ones. I mean, they're going to disappear very soon. Yeah, I will just copy then the one that I already have there and see what happens. Let's copy and see if that's going to help. Let's click on the stations again. Pittsburgh, 11th Street. Oh yeah, we need more here. Uh, manage vehicles. Copy. Good. And Houston. The rest one, didn't I? I? I'm pretty sure I already fixed that one. Just now. So maybe rest two is the other one. Yeah, okay. Yeah, rest two. Oh, that's on the internal. Interesting. Oh, I see, I see. Okay, so let's manage vehicles. And let's replace this with... Oh, these are even using buses? I forgot. Maybe a faster one? Okay, let's replace and then copy. I don't mind. Let's see what's happening with it. With time. And here I had the... Trams. Interesting. Yeah, I think I... Yeah, I chose for the internal ones to use buses because I have more choice. Correct. Alright, let's go back into expanding our production. Now, outside of the city road, doesn't matter. Let's take a... No, this one is ugly. 60. Hmm. Okay, let's take this one. Let's come here. 149. Cool. Are you ugly? Are you good looking? Road. I think you're fine. I was thinking... This is this is really too short for a train to be honest. Uh it should be it should be trucks. On top of everything, there will be trains coming through here, and it's going to be a little bit easier to create junctions, tunnels, bridges, everything that is necessary. And on top of everything, I will not connect this to a train, meaning to take the oil from here because it's going to be transported by ship, so no point. Let's do the same on this side. Come on, game, you can do it. Thank you. And yeah, I mean, it's going up a little bit. Okay, okay, we can do that. Um, let's see, buildings. What do I have to do? Cargo buildings, yeah. So I need uh, maybe two, three? Three, three on the right. Okay, in this case, why don't we do it like this? Like this? Or on the other side? They're going to come from the right and they're going to... I mean, both both sides uh, work, I guess. We can also put it in the middle of the road. Why not? There, No one else is going to use this road, so... Actually, I don't see why not. No, but it's going to be, it's going to be more difficult to do it like that. Uh, maybe I'll do it in the future. We'll see. Okay, so let's see which is the closest, sorry, the farthest we can go. Wait, let's first put 30 meters for bigger, uh, for bigger uh, trucks. Okay, something like this. Yeah. Okay. Okay, we are connected here. So they're going to come here and bring the route there. So this means this station has to be closer to the oil like this. This is cheating a little bit, but what can you do, you know? The game demands it. And in this place, we can actually put it on the other side. Why not? Just to have a little bit of a difference. Like this. Ah, and I'm adding platforms on the left because why not? 
uh, over here. Okay. So this is going to set up our crude. Awesome. Now, we need a tram depot unless we connect to the city, but I don't think so. Also, this port is going to be as far as possible from, from the city because also the residents are going to grow on this site. Let's see. Let's come here. Buildings, depot, and road depot, and... Yeah, let's add it on the opposite side over here. Like this. And now, lines. Let's do the lines. So we have a line from... For that, let's fix our mistake. Goodbye. And here. Goodbye as well. Okay. Now, new line. From, yeah, uh, that station from here to here, alternative terminals, load if available, full load any, don't unload and only load crude oil. Here, it doesn't matter. Actually, maybe I should have added more on this side, more terminals, but we'll see if we get traffic jumps because both of them are going to come here. So, yeah, uh, and here is only unload. So load, unload. OK. And this is going to be. Cargo truck and then. Uh, <laughs> this is El Paso. Well, it's going to be crude delivery pipe El Paso. Re no, this is oil oil well. Right, that's how it's called, right? Oil well. Yep. And this is Houston oil well. Okay. So new line from here, to here. Cargo truck. Route delivery. Houston oil well uh, clicking buttons as usual here take alternative terminals and here same now terminals yeah you can go to another one there we go cool now let's see actually before I start buying vehicles let's establish the rest the rest of the things so for a fairly similar distance here we have what is it three ships where is the line three ships so maybe we need three to four ships oh especially if uh, uh especially yeah three to four ships i think so so that means let's go to port cargo port uh, size, no terminals, because we're going to do it ourselves. To put it around here. I mean, they're technically going to go this way and surround the city a little bit. So yeah, that's that's pretty good, I think. Yeah, let's add it here. This is very nice. Very nice location. Let's configure and let's remove this. And we're going to add ourselves this one i don't think i will need more come on why you don't let me ah there you go okay we need two landings uh, i know that uh, the current duck boats or whatever i'm using there are small ships but doesn't matter there we go um we already no we don't uh in the meantime by the way something terrible is going on here and I would have loved for the commercial to start going here, but it's not. And I don't want these residents coming to this site. Thank you, guys. Please keep yourselves on the other side of town. For example, the industry as well is not needed here. There is enough space to grow on that side. Okay. Speaking of this, we are going to put another harbor 
it's definitely close enough what is happening here so it's going to be something like this all right like this does it look good i think so and let's just put it then boom okay let's go and build ourselves a street inside of the city uh okay i know this street is that one uh but actually let's take it from here like that it's not very nice is it let's take this and flatten this ground a little bit like this good now let's build this let's wait for the game to yep thank you game i took it too close and this looks nice to me okay and now let's connect over here come on game thank you uh and we have access yes we do now let's configure this and as usual let's delete and put ourselves the cargo terminal no <laughs> the luck man the luck let's put ourselves two landing zones okay come on come on you can do it thank you now uh connection has to exist on this side as well of course so let's do that but in this case we have the outside of the cd road Ooh. what am i doing here why are we so high what <laughs> what's going on game you're doing weird things uh, let's do it like this okay i don't know why i chose this one just for uh have something different i guess and connect like this okay we have access right of course we do we're close enough now um we need a line here so it's going to be new line from this port to this port here we can take alternatives and here we can take alternatives as well uh we need full loads why don't we take full loads i guess probably it makes sense all mm. load any here is nothing because uh we need to load let's load oil did i click it oil okay uh this is interesting I load oil and bring it here and then maybe with the same ships I can not because it's going to be different rates. Hmm. Yeah, that's certainly interesting. Do I bring it back so that I don't have empty ships or I do something else? Very, very interesting stuff. At the same time, I can also use because Houston eventually is probably going to use the own one refinery for its own. But for now, I'm going to deliver it there. Yeah. So yeah, let's uh, take the oil from here and unload. Unload. Wait, load here and do and do nothing else. And in this one, unload. Correct. Uh, I don't see the line though. Why is it not? Interesting cargo ship. This is going to be... Um, oil for Houston refinery oh and and in this case we are going to change the color to I think it was this one ah there is the line okay cool so last thing let's see let's see uh, in this case, I need some more terminals here, no? Yeah, and I also need some terminals. I need some terminals. Uh, we can do something else. A different type of... of uh, port. 
like this. And let's put landing on both sides. Perfect. Come on, thank you. Now, let's first check this one. No. Please. First of all, let's change the names, you know. Houston Port South. No, 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 no. This one is going to be... This is Houston Oil Refinery. Houston... Uh, oil Refinery Port. And this is going to be Houston Fuel Refinery. Fuel Refinery Port. Okay. Now, like I said, I don't need this. I need this. Thank you. And on the other side, we're going to use them for other things. Cool. So let's also try to keep away from the residents. So we need to be very, very far. Yeah. No, okay, I guess I guess this can work. Let's put this one here as well. And how far? Again, let's take our measurement. 320. Okay, so at that second depth here is where we should put the other one. So something like this. Okay. That looks good to me. Let's just finish the line. So from the oil refinery, let's add this station and that station. And from the fuel refinery, we're going to add this station and that station. Beautiful. I think it's very nice. It's going to keep away, not creating any unnecessary emissions for Houston. Good, good, good. Now. Um, I have a shipyard there. I don't think we need to use that one. Building shipyard. So I'm going to need some ships for the other one as well. So maybe a more central point like here makes more sense. Let's add that line as well. It's going to be from this one to the already known one. And yeah, this one is going to take... Certainly some lagging because it has a lot of yeah and the game breaking and it's just insane <laughs> insane stuff uh, This is fuel delivery So let's change it to cargo ship Fuel delivery uh, Houston Okay I Fuel delivery edit this is Houston Fuel re Refiner Refinery. What do I have, Miss Houston Fuel Refinery? Fuel delivery? I don't know. It's underlined for reasons. Okay. No, no, no. That doesn't work for me. Um let's let's actually use these ones let's use this okay and then let's use okay let's use this one and from here the existing one over there and this one as well here you can take uh three and four all right and the SEDC port i don't know i already have stuff here so maybe we can give you i'll give you 19 and 7 8 and 5 7 8 5 this looks pretty good to me and that's it i think we have all the lines necessary for the new production manage lines oh let's see them all so yeah we have deliveries here I have deliveries here and deliveries there pretty good cool now let's start buying some vehicles 
buy some vehicles uh cargo crude oil oh that's a punch oh man when there is so much choice uh why why this takes all cargo i don't understand Do, don't we have something that is specific ah this one you see something else oh cargo ah tank tank truck so if it's a tank truck we like it uh loading speed let's do loading speed loading speed and let's do this three tarpaulin truck and tank trunk tank tank truck okay the other tank truck has two this one has three and it's pretty fast so we are going to buy this one and we are going to add it to sorry we're going to add it to El Paso first. We're going to buy another one and we're going to add it to the Houston oil well. Okay, another thing I didn't see is this trucks go 60, right? Truck speeds, no. Do I have uh 65? Do I have the speed limit of the cars? Hmm. I forgot. Haven't done cars in a while. No. Let's see. Um, one. Outside. I was putting this 60. Yeah, this one is 60. Here is not 60. And that's it. Everything is 60 and 60 works for me. Cool. Uh, let's see how the lines are doing. So 21, we need 4. 100 manage vehicles that makes it 20 no so let's copy let's copy and let's copy five more times 421 okay for 20 if i sell one is it going to be 400 306 i had too many selected 421 okay let's make it optimal 400 i cannot be more it cannot be better than this <laughs> cool uh this looks good now the only problem i have is that i think this might be too short but we will see we will see uh okay so this is delivering the crude here producing oil and we're going to take it there now let's take the other Houston, that's 50. 50 means 8 trucks, no? No, maybe we don't need more terminals there. 2, 6, 8. 402. I mean, it's just perfect. Perfect. Look at our beautiful trucks. Go, my babies, go. Yeah, and the game is lagging. They're kind of nice, these trucks, actually. Okay. Now, ships. Let's see. So what did we say? We like this one very much, right? So let's buy one and let's put it on. Mm, Houston Refinery, right? Oil. Houston Refinery, SEDC, that should be this line. Uh, no, this is Houston Refinery. And then Houston, Houston Oil to Houston Fuel. Mm, just oil. Hmm. I think I didn't have such a line before so i don't know how to name it <laughs> they're usually better optimized but at least the good news is that we only need two ships which is great 400 and same goes for this line here Let's buy one and add it to fuel delivery houston fuel refinery One hundred and six. You know what that means. 
that means four ships perfect so now let's see what says here consumers suppliers yeah we're going to supply some don't worry okay uh is everything all right here yes it is are we delivering oof game locked yes we are look at that everyone is full amazing it's just that it's not producing fast enough <laughs> oh well that is looking pretty good i think one thing that i'm still very concerned about these charts yeah things are not looking as well as before you know fuel delivery nashville maybe maybe this was too early you know maybe i don't produce enough yet hmm Questions, questions, you know. Maybe we're going to do this. Uh, these guys are going to uh, not be here anymore. At least I know that I need two trains full once. They are just wasting money at the moment. Because we are not... We haven't started producing the fuel. Yeah, I, I was too much in a hurry, I think. Uh, cool. Let's see what who else. Fuel delivery in Nash, Oklahoma. Yeah, I know. Oh my god, the East Coast is costing... What? Why? <laughs> it was actually making money, now it's not. It's very interesting. Come on, baby, go deliver. Ah, I think I know why. Because of the new setup with the ships. Yeah, I didn't have fuel for a while. That must be it. What about here? Oh my god, look at this procession. It's amazing. And you have fuel when you're going... Ah, that's the Miami. The... Okay, fuel delivery. Okay. This is amazing, isn't it? I think it's just great. <laughs> Looks beautiful. <laughs> okay. With this, I will wrap it up for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. I would love if you share your thoughts of the series in the comment section. And as always, don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. See you in the next one.